let's create a classifier so we will so because we're going to have three classes that is so let's change this to list as well so to list and now we can look at the y we can see we have average poor or good that is three classes in this ratings and for that classification will do so let's import our addition tree so from sklearn dot tree import decision so decision tree classifier and let's run the cells everything works fine oh yeah something is wrong so skill learn run the cell again decision tree classifier decision okay again spelling mistake and decision okay now fine okay let's just move on to the next cell and in here let's create our rating model so let's just name it model it's fine and then our addition tree classifier so addition tree classifier and let's train it with our reviews that is this tfidf transform values from our ratings feature extracted etc etc so we have our model and then fit it with our reviews that is x input and then the output so let's run the cell and audition tree classifier is done so now let's say we want to predict the values for the same we can just take in the model or let's say we have a rating like uh, the product the product is not in good condition is not in good condition so we want this to be rated by our model so let's store this inside of list to work because our model wants in text data or we can store this inside of a text variable then we cannot pass this as it is to our model because you know that this is a text data it cannot be understood by our machine learning algorithms we need to change that into numeric values so for the same let's use the vector transformer so text feature extracted so our vector transformer you can see we created that in here we'll use the same vector transformer so vec dot transform then pass in our text then we want to extract the tfidf that is the term frequency and inverse document frequencies so for the same we have the tfidf which you created as well so tfidf transform method and in here pass in the feature extracted text or the review so text extracted and now we can pass this text tf to our model as input so our model dot predict the input or the rating for this text data so text tf and now don't pass this inside of any list or array just pass as it is to our predicted model and then we can run the cell you can see we have poor as the rating so it's obvious that the product is not in good condition the rating will be poor so we have successfully created a rating bot where we can pass in our reviews and it will tell what it is or rate it as as correctly so in the next lesson let's create a function where we can just pass in this rating as a string and then we will just get what is the rating for that or just get the rating or review printed and the rating beside it so we don't have to just perform all of this for each and every comment we want so see you in there so to ease up this task of our rating board or performing rating let's create a function so let's remove this and in here let's create a function simply rate and then we will get the comment so comments or reviews and make sure to create a list just pass in a asterisk in here because we'll get some sentences or a lot of comments so that stays as that and we have oh syntax error it will be in here and then let's just use pass for now and run the set so what we will do in this function well we'll get the comments then we'll feature extract or 
extract the features from the text then we will perform tfidf transformation and then we can pass that to our model to predict and then we can print in the review and is ready so let's do that in here so remove the pass first of all we need the feature extraction ones so f ex feature extraction that is our vector so we created that in here so we do not to fit that again we can just use the transform function so transform function then we need to pass in the comments so just pass in the comments then we can just perform the tfidf transformation so let's use the tf variable tfidf and transform so dot transform method and now we need to pass in the feature extractions so features from the comments and now we can pass this tfidf that is term frequency or inverse document frequency to the model so let's store that into a prediction variable so our model dot predict and we'll pass in our tfidf that is term frequencies and inverse document frequencies extracted from our comment and then we can print our comments so let's say we get for our comment and ratings in the thread so let's say we have review and rate or rate so that's a rat so rate in zip so make sure to use the zip function we discuss in the all built-in section so i'm not discussing that in here you can just go in the all built-in section and check that to use zip function to pass in two elements to a for loop so we have the comment and the predictions so the comment and the predictions and there we will print the comment so that is review and then that is followed by oh that will be a variable then we will print in a colon new line and in the new line we will have the rating so we will have the rating as the rate so column again and the rate so now let's run the cell and now let's call in our function so rate function in here we can pass in our reviews so let's say not in good condition as we pass not in good condition and uh, let's say it is satisfactory so run the cell you can see we get not in good condition rating as poor it is satisfactory we get the rating as good so we have created this rate function where you can just pass in the comments it will perform the feature extractions and transformation and prediction in this function and then it will also print the review and its rating that is done by our rating bot so that's it for this lesson